Hello everybody, welcome back to Octopath Traveler. Today we are going to be doing the story quest of the cleric. Alright, I already did your things. Battle is truly joined. I will cut you down. <laughs> Try death. Coming if thou darest. I'll do my best. My arrow. I'll not be defeated. First, uh. Out of my way. Come in, if thou dare. Over here. My turn now. My arrow fly and true. <laughs> Let your wounds be healed. Victory shall be mine. Out of my way. I'll not be defeated. Letting my arrow fly in true. Oh, 
How rude. Don't wait. Victory shall be mine. Let your wounds be healed. Come in, if thou darest. I'll not be defeated. Strong. Elemental defense, ally base damage to all foes, large amount to each. Protect the wall or revive. Up here. Now, let us hunt Put the lizards. Let in the hunt begin. <laughs> Let in my air. Hold him back, nothing. <laughs> Victory shall be mine. I think not. Well, then. <laughs> I grow stronger. This is... Shall be mine. I will cut you down. Well then, let in the hunt begin. It. Come in if thou darest. Out of my way. 
The battle is truly joined. My turn now. Oh, sacred life. Out of my way. Don't wait. Letting the hunt begin it. Standest thou against me? Then be hunted. My turn. Battle is truly joy. Letting my arrow fly in true. Letting the hunt begin it. Out of my way. How about you? <laughs> I'll not be defeated. How about you? Out of my way. Letting my arrow fly in trust. My turn now. <laughs> Let your wounds be healed. Well then. How about you? <laughs> Letting my arrow fly in. <laughs> Don't start things you can't finish. Got a nice little plum. My arrow fly in true. I'll do my best. Yeah. <laughs> my turn. No. What next? I'll not be defeated. Letting the hunt begin it. The battle is true. Letting my Which arrow way? fly in true. Be 
don't start things you can't finish. Yeah, it really is a bit, I won't say annoying, but it is a bit tricky because they tend to hide paths behind things. Truly joy. What next? You know, I bet those shadow guys really weren't like this. Knew it. Out of my way. Is it Hamid that I'm waiting for 500? Yeah. All stats enhancements you receive will last for one additional turn.
Letting the hunt begin it. Out of my way. My turn now. The battle is truly joy. What next? I'll not be defeated. The battle is here. With each battle, I grow stronger. Of thee who dost tread in, in these halls, I ask, art thou fit to lighten the flames and show in the past to all humanity? What? I am the guardian of the first flame. If thou wouldst call in thyself the flame bearer, thou must prove in thyself worthy. <gasps> I will not lose to you. <sighs> so, that's a big boy. Victory shall be I'll do my best. <laughs> Come in, if thou darest. <laughs> Here. Letting my arrow fly in true. Out of my way. Don't wait. Now then, out of my way. My turn now. <laughs> out of my way. Damn. The battle is true. Out of my way. Well then. Let your wounds be healed. Come in, if thou darest. Lightning, done my bidding. <laughs> my turn now. <laughs> my turn. <laughs> now then. <laughs> Come in. If thou darest. My arrow fly and true. Yeah, holding back nothing. I'll not be defeated. Christ, Marmot, calm down. No, then. <laughs> Truly joy. <laughs> well then, <laughs> let your wounds be healed. Victory shall pass. Letting the hunt begin. Next. <laughs> 
I intrude? My turn. How about you? Out of my way! My turn now. I'll not be defeated. Now then, out of my way! Come in. The battle. I see the defenses. I'll do my best. Let in the hunt begin it. I'll not be defeated. May the sacred flame shine forth. Victory shall be mine. I will cut you down! My turn. Letting my arrow fly in truth. Yes. Holding back nothing. Oh, that I just I killed a guardian friend. with that one? All right. Fear thou hast been judged worthy to bear in the sacred flame. Reach in out thy hand and take it in, in it Alfric's lanthorn. lanthorn. You see... Father? Your Excellency. My apologies. <sighs> Father? Mm, yes. Your Excellency. Mm, yes. Yes. What? Ophelia. <sighs> Ophelia. Liana. No. Yes. I understand. At at least it would seem you came through your ill-advised journey in one piece. I did, Your Excellency. And I can assume you set out with no preparation to speak of. For all your quiet dignity. I am sorry, Your Excellency. I only hope that this kindness of yours will not be your ruin. 
Your Excellency? You journeyed to the Cave of Origin so that Liana might stay here with me, did you not? <laughs> I will inform the Pontiff that there has been a change in plans, and that you will perform the kindling in Liana's stead. Speak with your sister, and learn what she has these many months. Your instruction will be abbreviated, but I know you are up to the task. Your Excellency. Your kindness <laughs> brings warmth and Excuse light me. to all around you, Ophelia. Just as does the sacred flame. Your Excellency, I... Uh. Ophelia, when I first took you in, I had a dream. A dream, Your Excellency? A dream of you. Bearing the flame to the world. Looking back now, I realize it was an omen of what was to come. Liana is a fine daughter, my pride and joy. She has served as a daughter of the church far better than I had any right to expect. But I know that it has not come easily to her. She has given up much of her true self to be who she must be for the church. I have not yet told Liana, but I fear that I am not much longer for this world. But your excellency, the healer said... I trust that I know my body better than any other. Your excellency... Oh, Ophelia. I am so proud of you and Liana both. Promise me that you will love one another forever. Your Excellency, I... Father, please, please don't leave us. Thank you, Ophelia. And with that, we should be off. Do take care. Take care yourself. I think Father was looking a little better today, don't you? We nearly had to tie him to his bed. He so wished to be here, too. <laughs> it's good to know he's acting more like himself again. Oh. Ophelia, I owe you an apology. Whatever for, Liana? When I first heard that you would go on the pilgrimage in my stead, to tell you the truth, I was relieved. The thought that I could stay here with Father instead of worrying about the kindling? I knew you would be putting yourself in great danger, and yet I was so happy. Can you forgive me, Ophelia? Oh, please. I am the one who should apologize. I have no right to be here and, well, I know that you only wanted to help me. And knowing that you will perform the right in my stead makes me happier than anything. Thank you, Liana. And so my journey begins. To Saints Ridge, Goldshore, and finally back to Flames Grace. Light the flames in each town. Form the kindling as our forebears have. I'll be gone for a while, but if ever you or father need me, pray send for me at once. Thank you, Ophelia. Really do take care of yourself, okay? Let us see how Saints Bridge and the Riverlands treats me. Till we meet again, dear sister. May the sacred flame light your path. And may it ever shine its warmth upon you. And so the cleric set out on a journey never meant to be hers. She must complete the kindling, the holy rite carried out every 20 years, to be able to return to the beloved family she wishes to protect. 
Where will this unexpected journey lead her? Only the gods may know. Stuff. So she needs to be twenty three for her thing. Twenty five, twenty one, twenty two. When the equipped character is afflicted with poison, see confusion, blindness, silence, terror, or unconsciousness, their physical and analytical defenses are enhanced. I guess we'll head south now. Cat. Me, then be hunted. Come in if thou darest. <laughs> My turn. <laughs> My turn now. Victory shall be mine. I will cut you down. If thou darest, I'll do my best. Out of my way. How about you? Out of my way. Come in, if thou. Darest. I'll do my best. Your wounds be healed. I'll do my best. Whoa. <laughs> the battle is <laughs> what next? Lightning done my thing. Where's the nearest tavern? Oh, Jesus.
guess the cat must be one of those killed to gain a shitload of XP enemies. Jesus. Toad, get out of here, teenage mutant Ninja Turtles! Truly joy. I will cut you down. <laughs> well then, come in if thou darest. Is truly joy. Over here. Come in if thou. My turn now. Letting my arrow fly in true. How about you? Out of my way. <laughs> well then. If thou darest, <laughs> out of my way. Let's do this. I appreciate it. Really. And that's that. Out of my way. What next? Now then. I will not be, I will not be defeated. My turn now. My turn. I'm ready. Try that. How about you? I'm out of my way. Come in. Come in. The hunt ends. Beginning. Out of my way. Now then. What next? My turn now. My turn. Try death. How about you? Let in the hunt 
begin it. I will not be defeated. The battle is truly joy. Letting my arrow fly in true. My turn. Truly joy. <laughs> I'll not be defeated. Ah! Letting my arrow fly. Ah! Now then. <laughs> With each battle, I grow stronger. Thank you. Let us go to the forest. Really? Me, At the city gates? Hunted. Coming, if thou darest. Raining arrows up on them. Where's the nearest tavern? Probably be the first two part city we've been in. His name is Cyrus, and he is a scholar. That this is Atlas Dam, nestled in the fertile plains of the Flatlands. It is home to the Royal Academy, where many a scholar studies night and day to bring light of knowledge to the royal family and to all the realm. He passes his days in the halls of the great library, devouring tomes to his heart's content. It is in that library where he learns of a grievous theft. Certain that the one of his fellow scholars is the culprit, Cyrus sits out alone to confront the man in his shady, shadowy suburban subterranean study. He will need wise allies on the path he has chosen. Not you. Okay. 
And so it was that Atlas Dam was founded some two centuries ago. Indeed, our fair city-state is among the longest standing on the continent of Austera. But there was another city-state with a history as long and proud as our own that came to a tragic ruin only eight short years ago. Now, who can tell me its name? How about you, Therese? <laughs> I, um, I think it was... Now, now. No need to get all flustered. There's no shame in not knowing an answer, so long as you have a desire to learn. The answer is in your textbook. Go on now, look it up. Yes, Professor. Let's see. <laughs> I believe it was Hornberg. That is correct. Hornberg was ruled over by a royal family, said to be descended from priests of an ancient and long-forgotten religion. On the other hand, our fair Atlas Dam was founded by one of the original clans that inhabited the Flatlands. Who can tell me how many clans lived in the Flatlands at the time? Your Highness? The histories have it that eight clans did live in the Flatlands in those days. Correct you are, Your Highness. It was a time of great strife here in the Flatlands, as the eight clans waged a long and bitter war. Change would come when the armies of Grandfort invaded these lands some two centuries ago. At the time, the rulers of Grandfort sought to exert their influence over territories inland. Ironically, this compelled the warring tribes to put aside their differences and unite against their common foe. Oh, but look at the time. Uh, we'll pick up where we left off next time. Don't forget to read chapters three and four before our next lecture. And be prepared to answer questions on any of the material within. Yes, Professor. Thank you for another most stimulating lecture, Professor Albright. Hello? Splendid! Professor Albright. <laughs> Your Highness. The truth of the matter is... But of course! Mm-hmm. In 
indeed. Very astute of you. Poor little fairies. <laughs> With pleasure. I thank you. Indeed. Day. Farewell. Ah, Therese. Yes, you have a call. Chicken with that easy game. I saw a chest down here and I'm gonna take it. Thought you could sneak that by me, did you? No, sir. It's me, Cyrus. <laughs> mm hmm. I see. With pleasure. I see. Many thanks. Interesting dilemma. Professor Albright. <sighs> hmm? The truth is, I see. Many thanks. Cyrus Albright, by your request, sir. Do enter. Mm. 
My apologies for summoning you on such short notice. How might I be of assistance, Headmaster? That treatise on arcane studies you published. What in the gods' names were you thinking? Sir? I do believe I made my hypothesis perfectly clear. I'm not talking about your hypothesis. You went out of your way to cite one of the texts in our special archives. The knowledge housed in those tombs is the Royal Academy's greatest treasure. It is not to be divulged to the public at your whim. Laying it bare in one of your silly papers is out of the question. I am fully aware of the value of those tomes, Headmaster. It is for that very reason I would share the knowledge with my peers. You are to share nothing! That wisdom is for the Academy and the Academy alone. But that goes against everything... Enough, Cyrus! Even my best argument is sure to fall on deaf ears. The Headmaster sees knowledge as a medal or precious stone. Something to be appreciated by its rightful owner alone. Knowledge is power, and power is to be hoarded. An unfortunate attitude in... My sincere apologies, Headmaster. It won't happen again. Is there anything else you need of me? That is all. You may go. Wait! There was one last thing. Sir? I heard the special archives will be closing early today. If you have research to do there, I would do so quickly. Good gods. It's as if he enjoys watching me suffer. Thank you for your concern, Headmaster. In that case, I'll be on my way. Enter. Uh, excuse me. What's the matter? Can I get back, uh, back to the library? Can I help you? A moment of your time. My apologies. Say it is not so. Actually... Oh. Why is it so silent? Mm. Oh, there we go. Indeed. Oh, the Cyrus think himself as a little Sherlock Holmes. I see. Leave it to me. Take care. Some research. Oh, the game is a hut. Hmm.
mend it. But of course. Oh. Ah, uh, no. Which means Yes. Shall we begin? Now then. So what chick got Russell? I mean Cyrus. So you got ice and fire. You can get lightning. Reveal the HP and a weakness. Deal fire. Deal ice. Deal lightning. Something. But first we gotta get you uh, kitted out, my man. You can't be going down to no place unarmed. You crazy? Team, let's head on down.
ready. Here we go. How about you? Victory shall be now. What next? I am ready. Now, what next? How about you? Here we go. The battle is truly joined. I am out of my way. I grow strong. <laughs> you won't feel a thing. I am ready. I will cut you down! All right. Cool off. What is the logical course of... I am ready. Victory, shut <laughs> With each battle, I grow stronger. Skill. May I have this dance? Now then. I am ready. The mold. Here goes nothing. Now, what next? I am ready. Now then. Bring it on. What is the logical course of action? Here goes nothing.
try this. I am ready. How about you? Bring it on. Oh, right huh, try again. The battle is truly joy. Bring it on. Search on you. I am ready. <laughs> what is the logical course of action? <laughs> Victory shall be mine. <laughs> Here goes nothing. <laughs> I am ready. Nothing. That'll do her. How about you? <laughs> I'm here. Goes nothing. <laughs> Show is over. May I have this dance? I am ready. Logical course of action. Now then. All right.
battle is truly joined. Out of my way! Here goes nothing. I am ready. The battle is truly joined. Well, what next? All right. Strong. Reduce the rate of random encounters. Mm, that's fine. For later, but I still, you know, want my XP. I can't do nothing without my XP, you know. I didn't really tell me anything about it. How about you? <laughs> All right. <laughs> How about you? <laughs> I am ready. Now, what next? Here we go. <laughs> Go. That'll do her. The battle is truly. <laughs> Whoops. An interest. <laughs> How about you? <laughs> what is the logical course of action? Up now. The All right. <laughs> Try again. Like, seriously, why would you set up shop down here? It's dingy, man. Uh, uh, what? Excuse me. A moment of your time. <laughs> Come now. The truth is... Uh, huh? I... 
Oho. Is that so? Listen to reason. Now, what next? I am ready. Have at you. I will cut you down. Here goes nothing. Battle is truly fair. I am ready. Nighthood, bring your shade. Does he throw a book at me? An interesting dilemma. The battle is truly joy. All right. Mm. That'll do her. Dilemma. Bring it on. How much HP does that thing have? Bring it on. That'll do her. No. I am ready. Oh, there we go. What is the law? You tell the truth, that's all flames. Rage, wrong. How about you? I am ready. Here goes nothing. I am ready. Nothing. That'll do her. How about you? I am ready. I am ready. The battle is truly joy. Here goes nothing. Let's try this. Here goes nothing. <laughs> I am ready. Victory shall <laughs> What is the logical course of action? Here we go. 
go. That'll do her. Victory shot. My blade is unbending. Watch my blade dance. I am ready. The mold. What's this now? Have at you. Out of my way. Bring it on. I got just what you need. Here we go. Bye bye. With each battle, I grow strong. <laughs> Just so. Say it is not so. Thank you. Indeed. <laughs> Actually, I see. Yes. Hmm. Actually. Autumnus. <laughs> oh, I have a feeling it's not going to be a nice reward. Brought Professor Albright, as asked, sir. Good. Enter. Thank you, Lucia. Yes, Headmaster. What can I do for you? <clears throat> Something tells me he's not about to offer commendation. 
Professor Albright, a most troubling report has reached my ears. A report, sir? An anonymous source claims that you have abused your prestigious position to enter into an illicit relationship with Her Highness the Princess. Oh. And you believe this report, sir? If it is untrue, then say so. Why, it is unfounded, unsubstantiated, balderdash of the highest order. I would like to take your words at face value, Professor, but I fear the situation is not so simple. A rumor regarding the royal family, even an unsubstantiated one such as this, is sure to spread quickly. If we do not take swift action, Princess Mary's good name could be forever sullied. That is something that simply cannot be allowed to happen. Surely you understand. And so what do you intend to do with me, sir? It is not an easy decision to make. Dismissing you outright would be tantamount to an admission of guilt. If I may be so bold, Headmaster, what about a sabbatical? Professor Albright has put on extended leave, while official accounts state that he's doing field work in a distant land. What say you, Cyrus? This way, both the Academy's reputation and your own will remain intact. My reputation? Do we have a problem, Professor? Not at all, Headmaster. On the contrary, this might prove the perfect opportunity. Opportunity? For what? As a matter of fact, there is a matter which has piqued my interest of late. I was just wondering when I might find the time to do a bit of research in the field. I think I will set forth on a journey. In search of an ancient tome that disappeared 15 years ago. Besides, if I am not permitted to share what I have learned with my peers and the public, there is little point in continuing my research here. Is that so? Do tell, Professor. What is it that you intend to investigate? As regards a certain tome. Now, if you will forgive me, I must begin packing for my journey. Good day to you, Headmaster. An enigma as ever, that one. <laughs> Professor! Oh, Therese, what is it? I... I heard that you were leaving the Academy. Then you heard true. P Professor, I I'm so sorry. I see. So you were the source of the rumor. You you knew? Not until just this moment, when you apologized. And yet, I cannot fathom your motive. Why would you tell such a terrible lie? You're always helping Her Highness, answering her every question. I just wanted you to pay more attention to me. And that's why you went to the headmaster. Y yes, but I, I just wanted to get you in a little trouble. I didn't think they would. I am so sorry, Professor. Can you ever forgive me? 
worry not, my dear. It just so happens that I was looking for a good excuse to go on a journey. You were? For some time now, I've wanted to travel the realm and see what can be learned beyond these halls. I dare say the timing couldn't have been better. You see, there's a certain matter I simply can't wait to investigate. So fret not, my girl. If for anything, you have done me a favor. Besides, I am not entirely without fault in the matter. Indeed, I have not been as attentive to you as I should. Had I realized your true intention sooner, I would not be in this position. Professor, whatever do you... If only I had realized how devoted you were to your studies, my dear girl. My studies? I have always striven to treat all my students equally. And yet, Her Highness is always eager to ask questions, and I was all too eager to answer them. In doing so, I may have given the impression that I favored her above you and the others. This was not my intention, but I am at fault all the same. Yes, if only I had seen you for the ardent and devoted young scholar that you are. Um, Professor, perhaps you're not quite as sharp as I thought you were. <laughs> yes? <sighs> Never mind. A man dedicated to his books. In that case, I should be off. Pray do not shirk your studies, my girl. Yes, Professor. Will... will I ever see you again? I do not see why not, provided we both still live. Just one more party member to go, and we'll be finished with the first chapter of the game. All I can about from the far reaches of hell. My erstwhile colleague of debt knows more about arcane studies than anyone I know. Last I heard, she sojourned in Quarry Quest. I should begin my journey there. Mm, who are you, mysterious person? And so Cyrus left the academy behind in search of the lost tome from the far reaches of hell. What dark secrets might its pages hold only the gods know. Oh, there you are, Cyrus. Level 24. Twenty-three, twenty-seven, twenty-four, twenty-four. Then of course there's twenty-one and twenty-two, and another twenty-seven.
was nothing. Truly joy. An interesting dilemma. Here goes nothing. I am ready. Victory shall be mine. Bring it on! Cool off! Now... You should have studied harder. Goat. I am ready. Nighthood, bring your shade. Now then. <laughs> An interesting dilemma. Here we go. <laughs> now, what next? I am ready. The battle is truly joy. <laughs> Here goes nothing. <laughs> Is truly joy. What is the logical course of action? Oh, flames, rage, wrong. I'm ready. Victory. My faith is unbending. I shall. The show is over. No, oh, he's already a tribe. Here we go. <laughs> I am ready. The battle is truly joy. I will cut you down. Goes nothing. 
nothing. The battle is true out of my way. I am ready. The show is over. Up here is just a dungeon, right? Right. Let us fight with honor. Here goes nothing. I am ready. It on. Here goes nothing. <laughs> They actually have to go up. Never mind. It's still a good thing I went down to get that shared treasure. <laughs> you won't feel a thing. An interesting dilemma. I am ready. The battle is truly joy. I will cut you down! Alright! Now. Here goes nothing! I am ready. The battle is truly joined! Out of my way! Victory! I am ready. The show is over. Shall be mine. Here we go. What is the logical course of action? I am ready. How about you? Show is over. Really? Could have sworn.
be mine. I will cut you down. Here goes nothing. I am ready. Victory shot. With each battle, I grow stronger. Is there no inn in this place? Oh, there it is. All right, I'm gonna be ending the stream a bit early, but that's because my wireless headset is now running out of battery. So I better stop and charge or else I'll just stop hearing everything and you'll stop hearing me occasionally speak. And we wouldn't want to have that now, would we? So thank you. Thank you for joining me as part of our Octopath adventure. I will see you later for more. Good day and goodbye.